doing. All right, DC, a lot of people, I, I can hear them screaming from the uh, from the cheap seats uh, saying, how bad, DC, how y'all talking about these people, but you don't mention this guy. Let's yeah. Let's talk about him, bro. You, you got to mention Sohan, and uh, we got to mention Keegan Murray, too, Q. We can't forget about him. I mentioned but, uh, Murray already, but, uh, but we can go back and how that. Go ahead, dude. Let's let's break about this. You you did you mention her? I did. I, I mentioned him, but you were yeah, so but enthralled. You was in, you were so enthralled with the with the Ivy that we we had we moved on <laughs> with him. But let's talk about Jeremy, man. Six nine two thirty out of Baylor, man. Man, listen, this this is another dude. He jumps off the take too, man. Uh, but a lot of it for me was uh just like defense and just making plays that needed to be made such an intelligent player we talk about a guy like larry nance you know he kind of fits that mold not that his game is like larry nance he ain't got that type of athleticism like nance but he does have some good athleticism for his size as you can see but he's just a guy that's smart man he does the little things like he he gonna set all them picks the screens he's gonna cut on time uh he's gonna pass the ball where it needs to go you're not going to find him making many mistakes. He can come in and he can play right now. You know what I mean? A lot of people comparing him to Draymond Green. They're yeah. saying this is the best defensive player in the whole draft. He, he's got a little bit of offensive game. Not much. But as you can see, that's his problem right there. He's he knocking them down there, man. But his problem is, is the three ball. If he can get a consistent three-point shot. You know he would be that guy that's 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 the thing with him but uh he's a guy that would fit us he could probably guard one through five to be honest um he's just he's a baller man but he's if you're getting jeremy sohan you're not getting him with this potential we talk about with Jalen ivy and shaden sharp and all of those guys you're getting him to be a role player but he would be a very excellent role player you know what i mean um he could he can fit in pretty much anywhere, man, and do whatever you ask of him. And as I was watching him through the tourney, man, all I seen him do was make plays, keep his team in, man, and do some phenomenal freakish stuff at times, man. He's very athletic, you know. Um, I like him. Uh, if the Pels drafted him again, I wouldn't be mad at all. I'd just be like looking like, okay, we got Jeremy Sohan, so when we go, we got to get another three point shooter. <laughs> so that pretty much be it. But man, can you imagine this guy out there with Herb Jones with the defensive intensity he plays with and just doing all those little things, man? The Pelicans will run like a well dog machine. Our only downside would be we got to find a way to improve our three point shooting if we got a guy like Sohan, because I understand he's working on his three point game, but I'm not going to, you know, kind of hold that to him and expect him to, you know, raise that through the roof. I mean, the brother shot. 29 percent from three-point line you know last year and he only scored about eight points a game so his his uh, you know calling card is really defense that's his thing you know what i mean uh they compare him to aaron gordon and i, I see ben simmons and i don't know where ben simmons gonna come from i guess it's just talking about defensively uh this is a brother who's he's six nine 230 you know he can guard centers so you you got a guy with that that Herb Jones caliber, close to Herb Jones caliber defense, because we ain't seen it in the league. We haven't seen it in the league yet. The DC all but, <laughs> He can definitely uh he can definitely ball on that side of the ball. And I think he would be like a bigger version of Herb. When you're looking at somebody maybe you could have at that small ball center role, you know, and come out there strictly for defensive purposes, you know give you 1.3 steals a game sadly you know he's he's like draymond though so you ain't gonna see a bunch of blocks you know you know, i don't see him getting a whole lot of blocks but whatever the center is he can definitely dim up and stop them from scoring it's just he ain't about to be swinging a whole bunch of them to the bleachers and be like some uh a rim protector in that way but he will protect the rim due to sliding over getting in the right spots taking charges you know uh good positioning making their shots harder. The dude is excellent, man, to be honest. Perfect.